We are living in a world based on sexuality. Nowadays, sexual education has become crucial for a healthy society. But what happens when this isn't the norm in some communities? Let's take a look at the consequences of the absence of sexual education. Bulgaria and Romania have the biggest adolescent birth rates in the European Union, three times higher than the European average, with over 30,000 pregnant teenagers in 2015, according to some extrapolations by the World Bank. More than 2,000 girls under the age of 16 give birth in Romania each year. So what are the complications? that come along with teenage pregnancy. First of all, it should be mentioned that there are voluntary cases and involuntary ones. In the involuntary example, girls either are the victims of sexual abuse or violence, pedophilia or incest, either the factors include misinformation upon contraceptive methods due to insufficient sexuality education. Second of all, pregnant teenagers are prone to health issues that include miscarriage or neonatal death. Complications of pregnancy and childbirth are the leading cause of death and disability in developing countries. Furthermore, more, the children of teenage mothers are often born underweight and experience health and developmental problems, plus the fact that the affected girls are often immature to raise a child and they are less likely to graduate from high school and more likely to live in poverty. Other risks found in the lack of sexual education are sexually transmitted diseases. One of the most widespread diseases in the European Union is chlamydia. It is 18 times more common than gonorrhea and in the last five years the number of this affection has risen to approximately 41%. It is usually found in teenagers, around 75%, and the most people infected are the girls between 15 and 19 years old. Romania and Poland are on the first places in the EU chlamydia statistics, as shown by the European Center for Disease Prevention and Control. Besides chlamydia, HIV is another risk factor. In Romania in 2013, the biggest number of new diagnoses with HIV infection has been found among teenagers between 15 and 24 years old. Moreover, the UN AIDS 2008 Global Report on the AIDS epidemic reported that only 40% of young people aged 15 to 24 have accurate knowledge about HIV. So why is it relevant to have sexual education? It has been shown that the presence of sex education reduces the number of teenage pregnancy and abortions, decreases sexually transmitted infections, HIV infections, sexual abuse and homophobia. In Finland, school-based sexuality education for young people was introduced in 1990, leading to an immediate decrease in teenage pregnancy rate. However, owing to budget constraints, both programs were drastically reduced used in the period from 1998 to 2006. This had an immediate impact on abortion and birth rates among 15 to 19 year old girls. The rates decreased again after the reintroduction of sexuality education and youth specific health services in 2006. In Estonia, increased knowledge about contraception and condoms, access to youth friendly sexual and reproductive health services and a supportive policy environment are thought to be the reason for the dramatic decline in STI rates among 15 to 24 year olds. Beyond that, by increasing confidence and strengthening skills to deal with different challenges, sexuality education can empower young people to develop stronger and more meaningful relationships. Good quality sexuality education has a positive impact on attitudes and values and can also contribute to the prevention of abuse, mutual respect and consensual partnership. Some other positive effects of sexual education include awareness of human rights, respect, acceptance, tolerance and empathy for others, gender equality, confidence and self-esteem, skills in contraceptive use, empowerment and solidarity critical thinking, skills in negotiation, decision-making and assertiveness, parent-child communication, as approved by United Nations Population Found, that has this motto, delivering a world where every pregnancy is wanted, every birth is safe and every young person's potential is fulfilled. What a lovely conclusion, isn't it? Therefore, it is highly important to introduce quality sexual education in order to pursue the life dream of a disease-free, happy and respectful world. Created using Powtoon.